story of how owning this Titanic Hubert almost caused me to get permanently banned in Pet Simulator X. To make matters worse, it was 100% my fault. Yeah, I'm owning up to it now. Here's what happened. Now this all started about a month ago when a friend of mine has them put out a comment asking what people would do for a million Robux. Another friend of mine, Mr. Bouchot, answered by saying he would wear a maid costume and shortly after, uh, well, let's just say he won a million Robux. <laughs> then the cycle repeated when Bouchot asked what people would do for a hundred thousand Robux. I, being the fun guy I am, said I would tell people to subscribe to his channel in a video, just messing around, and that's when this happened. All right, I'm gonna give him a hundred thousand Robux, guys. I'm about to go poor. <laughs> there you go, Mr. Nightfox. That worth it, guys. So yeah, I got a hundred thousand Robux. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Do you like Roblox content? Are you a gamer? Are you a furry? Mr. Bouchot isn't. He's a variety YouTuber and a good friend. You should check out his channel if you're looking for some quality vids from a quality dude. Subscribe to Mr. Bouchot today and- All of your wildest dreams will come true. Now what does this have to do with me getting banned, you ask? Getting to that, calm down, jeez. With my newfound hundred thousand Robux, I was planning on using it for a future hatching vid in Pets MX. Then I saw it. Somebody on Twitter was offering to trade a Titanic Hubert. And at this point, I had spent over 250,000 Robux getting it and knew my chances were slim. So I made the logical decision to give the Robux that I got from Bouchot and throw it over to the person who shall remain nameless for his Titanic Hubert. Yes, I cross-traded. For those that don't know, cross-trading is actually highly illegal and will get you banned from the game. Accepting Robux, buying claim pets off of eBay, or trading other items in other games for pets in Pets MX isn't allowed. You can only use the in-game currency or pets to trade for other pets. At the time, I was so blinded by the prospects of getting the Titanic Hubert and had just got the 100,000 Robux that I really wasn't thinking about what I was doing. Everything sort of just fell into my lap at the same time and it just made sense in my head. It wasn't even until I started getting called out left and right in the big games discord server from people snitching on me that I realized what I was doing was wrong. Now, officially, this trade was made in a gray area is I did actually give a fair amount of huge pets in game for his Titanic pet. The trade was official, but it was a huge win for me and a huge L for the other guy. Seeing as that I've donated 100,000 Robux before on Please Donate, I could officially say that I just made a legit trade in Pet Sim and then decided to be nice and give away the 100,000 Robux that I had won. But uh, between you and I, we, we really know what happened. Now, here's a life lesson I want everybody to learn. If you do something bad, own up to your mistakes. It usually goes better for you in the long run. I knew I messed up, and seeing all the comments in the big game's Discord server, I knew eventually a moderator would see what happened. I didn't want them to find out what I had done from others, I wanted them to find out from me. So I messaged Coilist and admitted to everything. He was, yeah, admittedly disappointed, but was willing to let me off the hook as long as I did something in return. So now to keep from being banned, I have to do a forfeit. I wanted to do the forfeit to show I'm not above the law. Everyone should have to follow the same exact rules. Even though I've spent so much on the game, I'm a part partner and uh, a fairly handsome YouTuber if I do say so myself. So I reached out to Coilist and had him give me a challenge. If I complete the challenge, I don't get banned. If I don't complete the challenge, well, uh, that's it gamers. It's game over. What was the challenge you asked? Well, he actually talked to the dev team and said that I have to open 250 exclusive dominance eggs and then give away every single pet. Titanic, rainbow huge, shiny huge, everything. Oh boy. People say I'm one of the luckiest people around. So everybody gets to borrow my my luck today 250 of these eggs at 3200 for 10 means to keep from being banned i have to basically spend 3200 robux 25 times for 80,000 robux that's the price to keep from being banned well let's do it gamers and there it is 250 eggs all ready to be hatched and i thought it was fitting that i actually kept the titanic hubert the pet that actually caused all of this it's your fault hubert and we're gonna sit here and hatch all of these eggs right here we're gonna see how many huge pets we can hatch and then all the pets that we don't hatch we're gonna take over to the huge -tron machine and make huge -tron eggs to hatch more huge pets to give away because let's face it 
these little guys right here are currently worthless with the RAP system. So yeah, I don't want to give away worthless pets. That, that's pretty much what I was getting into. Okay, all right. <laughs> Just like in any other hatching video fashion, I definitely want to try my hardest. So I'm going to turn on all the boosts. And we're going to go over to our good friend Pete. Yo, what's up, Pete? Actually, you know what? No, last time I did a hatching video, Pete 2 was actually the better ones. Yo, what's up, Pete 2? You know what, man? I don't know if I want to call you Pete 2 anymore. Maybe you should be Pete 1. Help me hatch some huge pets. You see this massive derpy titanic cat behind me? Yeah, I, I got to do a forfeit and uh, I got to hatch some eggs and give them away. So like the more huge pets we hatch, the more huge pets I give away. Okay, apparently Pete 2 don't care about the children. You want to try it again? Here, I'll even help you. I'll click that one for extra luck. Oh, Pete 2's redeeming himself. It's growing. Hey, we got our first huge and exclusive Storm Dominus. Let's rapid fire this. Let's do like three hatches at once. One, two, three. And we got a whole lot of nothing. Yo, Pete 1, you ready to redeem yourself? Five hatches. Let's see if you can do any better. Nope. Nope. So many huge pets. Come on. Come on. Where's the... Oh, this one's growing. And we got the other one. The huge Inferno Dominus. One for one. Yo, that means we got to have a tiebreaker round. Here we go. Three eggs each. Shinies, rainbows, huges. Or uh, absolutely nothing. P2, you got a chance, man. You got a chance to still be the best. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's nope. going to... All right, well, I would call this a tie, but with the two huge pets, Pete 1 had got the more rare one. So, yo, Pete 1, you won this time. I have the perfect place to go, actually. Let's go to Cat World. Let's go visit our mortal enemy, <laughs> Queen Tabitha, who absolutely hates my guts because for months, I called her a man and ugly. I called her King Ugly, and that's, like, bad on both parts. Yo, what's up, Queen Tabitha? How's it going? Yeah, 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 I know you're angry to hear, see me here and everything, but uh, look, I, I got something that you're probably really going to enjoy hearing. You see this big, massive, derpy cat? What? That's your uncle? I'm sorry. My bad. I didn't know that. Yeah, well, uh, Hubert here, I accidentally did something bad to obtain him, and so now I got to do this weird forfeit where I got to hatch eggs, and then I got to give all the eggs that I hatch away to other people. Okay, you don't need to rub it in my face. I don't know why you got to be that mean. So you want to, like, help me out? Two. Oh my god. Oh my god. A rainbow. I gotta give the rainbow in a way. Tabitha, I hate you so much. Why did you rub that in? That's insane. It's a rainbow. Oh my god, again. Oh god. Okay. All right. All right, let's speed round the rest of these. I'm down to the last three eggs. Okay, you know what? I'll take it. All right, well, now we gotta do the second part to this stupid forfeit. And that's to take all the exclusive pets that I didn't get huge versions of and put them in the Hugetron machine. Oh boy, we got a lot. All right, let's do this. Now I didn't actually have to do this part and I could do all 100 and get free exclusive eggs, but man, that wouldn't be a forfeit. You guys have watched my videos. You hit that subscribe button. Just count this as a way that I repay you. Yeah, this gonna take a minute. Let me speed run this part as well. Oh no, did I see what I thought I just saw? Insane luck for 10 minutes. All egg luck has been increased by 25 eggs luck. Well, I don't have enough to actually make another egg, but we do have all these eggs to hatch still. Well, we're in the insane luck area and we're gonna go to the person that I usually have the most insane luck for. And that, my friends, is Lord Nathan. Lord Nathan. <laughs> Okay, I just explained everything to Lord Nathan. He knows the drill. Let's do this. He's, I'm gonna, oh God, I'm gonna hatch three. In a sane luck server with all of my boosts on and Lord Nathan luck. What do we get? <laughs> that wasn't as good as I thought it would be. Lord Nathan, don't you care about the children? Give us some luck, man. Give us some luck. We got insane server luck. I don't know what to tell you guys. He he was he was trying. We got two eggs left. It, Lord Nathan, come on, man. Just 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 show us. Show us how lucky you are these days. 
I mean, that, that is a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. We got one egg left. I'm gonna save it and I'll tell you why. But before I tell you why, I'm gonna hop over to the bank. I'm gonna join this person here who only has a useless bunny and I'm gonna deposit three of them in here. And then I'll hop in this bank. This one's empty and I'll deposit three of them in here. And then the last three will go in here. So for all those keeping tally at home who actually participated in the challenge to see how many you just like it, the answer was 13. Man, that's an unlucky number. <laughs> so now all I gotta do is go to one of my sub servers and we'll go to my Night Fox Discord server all the way down to the VIP servers and we'll join one of these where there's only one guy in here. Let's see if we can find this guy. Hello? Maybe he's in the doodle world. Oh, he hatched a secret doodle parrot. He's hatching. Okay, where is he hatching at? There he is. He's in here hatching. Hi. How are you? You want a free huge pet? Yeah, this is about how making friends goes for me. <laughs> I ask them questions. I be nice and polite. I brush my teeth. I look good. And I just get nothing in return. Next server. Oh, yeah, there's a lot more people in my second server. Hello. And again, crickets. <laughs> there's way more people in this server. How come nobody's talking to me? Also, the rainbow. What is 166 billion? Oh, epic Vulpix said, oh, my God. I'm to spawn. And there he is. Look at this dude. Look how cool he looks. Look at the fox on the top of his head. Can you see? Sign my butter, Fox. Yeah, sure. First, let's play a game. Game. Get, you know what I mean. I'm about to hatch a huge Atron pet. If you guess the pet, you keep the pet. Pterodactyl, Cobra, Orca, Angelus, a Chameleon. He thinks maybe a King Cobra. Okay, this is what I was wanting to save the egg for. What did we get? It's up there. We'll click it for extra luck. King Cobra luck. And I'll actually do the thing that I probably should do and actually sign all of these. Let's send him a trade request. Let's give him the King Cobra. And I'll sign his Butter Fox <laughs> for whatever reason. And he said, wow, my first machine huge. You're welcome, gamer. For whatever reason, uh, he's the only one who actually said anything. I think everybody else in here is AFK. So that means we got to go to a public server. For starters, I think I'm going to give everybody in here that has a zero a huge pet. So that's, uh, oh, that's quite a bit. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. All right, well, hopefully they know who I am because they about to. Who's this person? Scahoney. Scahoney has zero. Hey, yo, what's up, dude? Want pet? Okay, he spoke to me. What do I do now? What do I do now? I know what to do now. Let's just start small. There we go. Dude, Jamie says, oh my God, I'm a huge fan. Can I have a huge? Dude, Jamie. Dude, Jamie. Where is this dude at? He's not even on the list. I guess that means he's a really small boy. He looks like a King Cobra kind of guy. There we go. That's done. Just like that. Now he's on the list. Uh, Dariario. <laughs> However you say his name. You can kind of see he's right down here at the bottom with a big fat zero. Let's see if we can change that, shall we? Tell you what, we'll give him the new one. He says hi. Enjoy. With that, now we've only got two people in this server who need saving. Just gotta go find them. There's some people back here at the Doodle Cave. I wonder if this is two of the people that maybe don't have any huge pets. Wow, we got a lot of people back here. Weirdly, none of these people are the people that I'm looking for. Let's see, who else? We got We got Shadow Demon and then this other person. Let's see if I can just trade them. This one right here doesn't have anything. Either one of these. First one to do it. Oh, Shadow Demon did. There we go, Shadow Demon. No, no, no. You, you can keep that. Okay, why not? There we go. And just like that shadow demon on the board this person just isn't answering they're probably afk but you know what i'll say uh this server has been saved from the rap wrath it's time to go to the trading server Oh my God. I'll give you this, man. He did it at the last second. It was right there. I was about to leave. Now I have officially given away all the huge pets in this server to people who didn't have one already. I have saved this server from not having huges. Let's go to the pro server. Somebody else has a Titanic Hubert. Wait, is that a Teletubby? Ugh. All right, let's start an auction. Let's lift this pet for one gym. Let's see it go up. Somebody legit offered one gym. Okay, now it's 6 billion. 6.3. 29 billion. 35 billion. 41 billion. 43 billion. And what did it sell for? 45.7 billion. Let's do this one. It's worth 52. Will it sell for 52? It's got my name on it and everything. Oh, it's already at 50. It's at 52.5. It sold for 85 billion. All right, while that's going on, I think I'm gonna claim a stand. Everybody's here. Okay, let's do um, let's do this one right here. Let's put all these guys for one billion. Why not? 
This person is literally gonna steal everything. Wait, Crocodile hasn't done it yet. Oh, he did that one. It's a freaking bot. Did you see it teleport? It's about to buy this one too. It did it. It just stole that pet. This is an alt account bot. It has got some kind of weird script on it. It literally goes into trading servers and it instantly just teleports to on top of my thing just so it can buy my pets. Hey, uh, anybody that watching this that's a dev, you wanna go ahead and just ban this person? That would be cool. I've got one pet left. I'm about to auction this pet. It's it's worth 166, but it's signed. What will it go for? It's already 285. Well, I think this dude just won it. Uh, no, it's still going up. Oh my god! And it sold for 333 billion. Well, I think we did pretty good here, and I think with the added money that I just got, I'm gonna start a couple diamond parties. Have fun, gamers! And with that, the challenge is over. I have sold every pet, and then somehow or another got this little guy. But the challenge is complete. I will now no longer be banned, which means I can own this guy in peace. Hey, what's up? You should subscribe. He already does! Yo, be like peanut butter here. And you never know. You might end up with some awesome stuff, like 100 billion gems and a signed Valentine's cat. Listen, it was all I had on me. Goodbye, gamers! Everybody's watching, all eyes on me.